I just jumped off the fucking balcony, almost fucking twisted my ankle on some motherfucking spider woman shit. Like, it was just a lot. So, like, when I had seen Ivory, I had apologized to her because we were supposed to, um, Barbie had called me over. She wanted me to watch the episode with her. But when I got there, you know, Barbie, Barbie cool with everybody. Like, you feel me? Barbie is a mutual person. So she had everybody where she was at. And I'm like, uh-uh, I don't want to be around them. Like, fuck that. Like, let this episode drop. And because I heard a lot of shit, so, you know, I don't want to be around them. So, um, uh, Isaiah and Barbie was like, Liddy, you know, I really don't want to fight you. I'm like, I don't care if she do. I don't want to be around nobody, like, off the show. Like, you guys, in real life, I'm, like, a very, um, paranoid person. Like, especially after being on reality TV, like, I'm very paranoid. So, like, if I feel like we had any type of smoke or if I felt like it was something, you feel me? I don't want to be around you. I'm not about to fight your ass for free. Like, especially if I don't understand, like, what the problem was. But I knew she was mad about the egg. So, long story short, I apologized to the bitch. The bitch accepted my apology. I asked her, did she jump me? She said no. But I don't care what nobody say. Me watching the tape, I feel like I got jumped, and I can feel like that. Like, it's me. It's not y'all. It's not nobody else. It's how I feel. Um, so the bitch is mad. She's a mad bitch. She's mad about the egg, and I know, I know she's mad because I know that shit hurt it. So I know she's mad. So um, I don't understand why she thought it was cute to steal my baby chain. First of all, I see a lot of people talking about that shit like, well, why did you hire your baby chain? First of all, my baby, she broke her chain. So I'm her mother. She gave me her chain. I put it in my bag. I forgot to put it up. It was in my bag. So when before I left to Atlanta, I had a show, and then I went back to where Mulan and Barbie and all them was at, and Ivory was there. She had just came back to the hotel that night, and she was crying and shit about a situation that happened. But I'm not even no bitch like that to say, you know, why she was in that moment or what happened because it's just not my business to tell. You feel me? So I'm just like, okay, well, you know, we, we going to Atlanta. So, boom, she texts the people. Boom, um, we end up going to the airport together. There's a lady named Keisha. Can you clock this, please? Keisha. Keisha, she had um, picked us up from the airport because we was waiting for a long time. Like, we was waiting for a long time at the airport. And um, Ivory had a fight or whatever, so her, her knees was, like, really scraped up and shit. So Keisha had, you know, was like, oh, Liddy, she's with you, so, you know, I'm going to make sure she's straight. So she took us to the CVS. She really played nurse to Ivory, like, you feel me? And shout out to Keisha, like, shout out to Keisha. Keisha is some, um, I had um, performed at her daughter's prom and shit, like, Keisha's real cool, like, you feel me? And she wants to come to the boxing match to support me. So, long story short, boom, you know what happens at the boxing match. We go back to, the, it's time to go, and we have to go back. We clean up the Airbnb. Um, I put my jewelry on the bed. I was cleaning out my bag. I put my jewelry on the bed. So when I put my jewelry on the bed, next thing you know, I, I, I wasn't paying attention that she had took some of my jewelry too at the time. So when I texted her, like maybe I was looking for it and I had texted her like, hey, did you see my baby chain? She told me that she had lost her jewelry. And then when I had seen her in the house, she had told me, oh, I found your baby chain. So I had said, give it to me after the show. Like, you feel me? Like, give it to me. Like, I'll see you, you know? I'll see you, like, you know? So to be saying, to be saying that, like, you stole my baby chain, like, like, come on now. You, you, why? You lose her chain. Like, take from me. Take from the mother. If you want to fight me, you want to beat me up, and you feel some type of way, that's fine. But don't take it out on my baby, though. Like, my baby, she, your baby about, what, six or seven? My daughter, she's old enough to know. She's old enough to look at this show. So if bitches want to fight and give me the chain back, we can do that. I don't give a fuck. But 
there, there's no, there's no beef there, but we could fight. But just if you got my baby shit, wherever you want to meet at, we can meet at, and then we could fight, and then just give my daughter her shit. Her daddy bought her that, and she love her daddy. She had daddy's girls. But if you want to fight me, we could fight, and I don't have to go to no fucking reunion. I don't even really care to go to that reunion. I don't feel like they talking enough money for me. So yeah. But back to this episode. Um, 